Linux furnace Wall controller Critical alert codes 35 and 276 What should I do? Safety concern? Hello, I need the model number of the, the furnace. It is inside the furnace in the same space as the gas valve in most cases, and includes the serial number and blower motor amperage rating. That is how you make sure you are looking at the right tag. The critical safety features on a furnace have manual resets. If the furnace operates at all it is not one of the key safety error codes. However all furnaces should be considered unsafe and need to be inspected every year by a licensed gas appliance technician for cracks in the heat exchanger. Get me the full model number and approximate age of the furnace. We can go from there. Thank you. The model number is as SLP 98 DFV, and on the permit it is listed as SLP 98 B 90 DF. HTTPS colon slash www.linux.com slash PDFS slash installation underscore maintenance slash Linux underscore SLP 98 DFV underscore IM dot PDF. Tell me please if that looks like the manual or not. See page 54. Looks like it might be a pressure switch problem. Error 276 refers to error 228. I do not see error 35. Look for a sticker next to the wiring diagram for that. HTTP colon slash screencast.com slash t slash rtsbhtv that is the pressure switch. Remove the two rubber tubes. Blow them out. Then poke a paper clip wire in each nipple those attached to to clean them out. Then do this test next stand next to the furnace after the thermostat has been turned off for 5 minutes. Listen intently as someone else turns the thermostat to heat and sets it for 85F. You should hear the small inducer fan start right away. Then a faint click after 1 to 3 seconds, that is the pressure switch closing dot then in 15 to 45 seconds you should hear two more faint clicks. That is the ignition relay and gas valve relay closing dot then within 5 seconds you should hear the main burner fire. In about 30 seconds the main blower should come on. If the main burner goes off after 2 to 5 seconds or within a minute or so tell me about it and the number of seconds involved. Repeat that a few times until you get familiar with the sounds, then tell me in detail how far the sequence goes before it stops. It is also a good idea to replug all of the connections in the unit, that burnishes any oxidized terminal connections and will sometimes solve the problem, especially at the printed circuit card and in any sensor Molex connectors. Do that with the power off to the unit of course. We can go from there. Thanks I will get a service pro in. Is this currently a safety hazard? There are risk here saying that anything is a safety issue or not. Especially without testing the system. However, generally these furnaces are well protected. This situation you are having is not a safety issue. Generally, but not always. Please do not forget to rate my work, it's how I earn a living and does not affect your charges. Thanks. One last question. Thank you. The codes went away overnight. Is that a good sign? The codes going away is not a good or a bad sign. It points to an occasional problem, that will very likely return. If you rate my work so far I can hold the question open for any further follow-up you might need when the codes return etc. Thanks, not increase your charges, but is how I earn a living comma backslash. Okay, will do, thank you. 
If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.